petty trader in Delta State lament on the exorbitant extortion by the police. That is something serious and I think a lot of things is like going crazy in this country. That is what I believe about the whole thing. These are petty traders. We are supposed to encourage them to become entrepreneurs, to make money for themselves. Instead, we are discouraging these people by, you know, initiating a kind of a tax system that we exploit them for that. That is something I'll be talking about in this particular video. Just before I jump right in, I want you guys to kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel, hit the subscribe button below and the bell notification icon to always get notifications each time I upload my videos. But if already subscribed, thank you for subscribing and make sure you share my videos across all social media platforms so that others will get to see what is trending and what we are talking about on social media. Lebanon ambassador Hussein Diab walked out of National House of Reps members during a meeting and that is something serious and that is something that I have to look at in this particular video because I believe that um, these are Nigerian politicians they've not earned respect for themselves that is what I believe about the whole thing in and outside the country because this kind of things will not happen in US an ambassador walking out of uh, the national reps um, uh, members meeting and you know what are you bigger than them there was a kind of someone uh, to actually talk about a nigerian domestic uh, servant in lebanon being uh, exploited and then being oppressed in lebanon uh, the one who actually talked about this and he said that he expected a closed door meeting with these people that he didn't need any camera there he didn't need any kind of uh, sort of things and this people want to discuss that on camera so that the whole world because it's affecting Nigerians so that the whole Nigerians will get to see okay or get to hear what is happening to their brother brothers and sisters in Lebanon and that actually um, you know anger this guy and he walked away from national house of reps members and that is insulting and i think these guys they've not actually um you know kind of uh, respected themselves or earned respect for themselves that is why this kind of thing is happening to them that is what i believe about the whole thing and i think they actually need to uh, look inward and start finding a way to building confidence you know um around the society on themselves because a lot of people don't respect these guys because of their performances so far and i think i don't need to blame the people i don't need to blame them for not respecting these guys because when you check okay we gave you guys mandate to actually okay give you our resources to you know administer for uh, the common good of nigerians but these guys are busy uh, exploiting and then you know a kind of ripping us dry and that is why uh, a lot of people are not respecting them anymore anybody any foreigner can just come into this country and do anything provided you pay the um, normal reality or homage to these guys and that is why this kind of things um, is happening and that is what i believe about the whole thing because these guys they need to actually earn respect for themselves if they don't earn respect for themselves believe you me more that is uh, more disrespectful than this will happen and a lot of people will actually cease to respect these people give them iota of respect anymore that is what i believe about the whole thing and this is disrespectful and these people they need to find a kind of solution to this kind of thing because this guy did it and another person will do it and nothing will happen to the person that is what i believe about the whole thing back to the trader the petty trader who lamented on camera uh, stating the exorbitant extortion by the police at Imunede in Delta State of Nigeria and that is something serious because a lot of people reacted to that video you know that video is making a round on social media a lot of people are re still reacting to that video and that is something serious because um, traders petty traders who hardly make enough money for themselves you are you know exploiting them uh, kind of doing all those sorts of things to them discouraging 
hindering them from doing businesses daily activities if they don't do business what do you want them to do that is what i believe about the whole thing but i think these guys they've not done well at all i remember when uh, the cross river state uh, governor uh, ben iid cried on the national tv over this kind of thing and this kind of thing is happening in delta state and i think the governments i think uh, you know governors they need to brace up to discourage these kind of things if they want to build a prosperous state if you discourage a lot of people from business by exorbitant extortion i don't think you'll be building a successful or a business minded state because we are supposed to encourage these petty traders to doing business and now they are discouraging them using the police to oppress them and doing sort of things yes i kind of understand that sometimes okay you ask them not to trade in this place not to do this not to do this okay you should find a way to rearrange or reorganize the society and then make them to be comfortable doing their businesses that is what i believe about the whole thing but this video actually touched my heart and i decided to share this video with you guys so that you we understand what a lot of people are passing through in nigeria all in the name of trying to earn a living in nigeria woman and the police don't tire us every day for say two thousand what well, uh, police go come collect ten thousand what do we want more do more leave the community for now we won't be selling down we're not going to talk food again what it be that one what it be that one we don't tire us any woman that will carry me go and go talk my belly. Let me say I'm gonna sell pure water, they'll collect ten thousand. Why? Why? What did I want to do for them? Deep your please, I take on I take back God you deep your make you they go. I take back God you deep your make you they go. Leave us alone, I'm tired. All right, guys, this reminds me of a situational drift theory. I was taught in school, I read a book on that, that a lot of people took to crime because of the situation they, are, they were faced with. And I kind of understand that this kind of thing can further propel this kind of situational drift theory where the people, they have to take to crime a lot of things and then just to find a living for themselves i think we need to discourage these policemen from doing that further and the only way to do that is to use the government institutions to do that because we can't do that ourselves we can only talk about that on social media but we can't really um you know enforce that and make that come to reality that is what i believe about the whole thing because i have met with a lot of people that said man i decided to do this because i could not get a decent job for myself i could not you know earn money for myself and the rest and i think it's pretty disturbing that is one thing that a lot of guys need to actually understand at this particular time just before i jump off i want you guys to kindly subscribe to my youtube channel hit the subscribe button below and the bell notification icon if you are yet to subscribe to this youtube channel but if already subscribed thank you for subscribing and make sure you share my videos across all social media platforms so that others will get to see what is trending on social media and then contribute to what we are talking about on social media woman and the police don't tire us every day for say two thousand what well, uh, police go come collect Ten thousand. What do we want more do? More leave the community for now. We want be selling down. We not go chop food again. What it be that one? What it be that one? We don't tire oh. Any woman that will carry me go, I go talk my belly. Let me say I go to sell pure water. They collect ten thousand. Why? Why? What did I want me do for them? Deep your please. I take on. I take back God you. Deep your make you they go. I take back God you. Deep your make you they go. Leave us alone. I'm tired. You, you guys, you have a, you have a role to play in that rubbish. You be collecting money from guys, and you will not. I want to zip up. How can you? Go and search your, your conscience. It's very, very bad. Before you talk to other girl now, you be saying how much? Even me at my age, I have girlfriends of your age. Daddy, how much will you give me? Am I lying? Stop collecting money from boys. Why you collect money from boys? Anytime they have the girl, they will deal with you. Oh my boy, that's so